I've got some help in the kitchen today with me. I've got Viola Davis and Bryce Dallas Howard from the movie The Help, and they're cooking with me today. Get out! Mm? Starting with elegant stuffed eggs. Oh, it's really good. That is so good. And then I'm going to take their breath away with spicy pecan fried chicken. This is over oh, the top. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. And to keep it hot, We've got southern collards with cornmeal dumplings. You're so good, I'm sweating. <laughs> I know, baby! <laughs> and for dessert, it's a milk and cookie trifle. Oh, this looks so good! <laughs> this is, might be, like, the best day of my show life. Oh! <laughs> this is Bryce Howard. This is Viola Davis. These <laughs> girls star in the movie, The Help. I'd like to do a book of interviews from the point of view of The Help. It'd be good to get it right. <laughs> well, she told me what y'all was up to. I'm gonna do it. I got to come up with your questions, too? Oh. Your friendship. It's against the law, what we're doing. Don't give up on this, Skeeter. Broke the rules. Every white home should have a separate bathroom for The Help. Hey, we should just build you a bathroom outside, Haley. Their courage. Y'all brought me into this, but I'm gonna finish it. Gave them a voice. You should read the book. It's quite scandalous. <laughs> Their words changed everything. Oh, Missy, you're going to jail. <gasps> you're a godless woman. From DreamWorks Pictures. Courage about overcoming fear and daring to do what is right for your fellow man. Every story matters. We gonna done it now. Let me tell y'all something. That pretty little girl down there, she's the meanest little B.I. <laughs> you have ever seen in this movie. <laughs> and Viola was steady, faithful, loyal. And 20 pounds heavier. And yes. 20 pounds heavier. Mm -hmm. I did not recognize you. Fried green tomatoes and fried butter on the fried bread. <laughs> And it was fun doing it. Yeah. And, and so did Bryce. Yeah. I you had to, too. I was asked to gain mm -hmm. weight, which is the best thing that anyone could ever ask a woman to do. Oh, oh to goodness. Especially in Mississippi. Oh. My gracious. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. All right, now we're going to make an elegant stuffed egg. I really need to learn how to cook here. This is this is my opportunity to learn how to cook. You don't cook, Bryce. I, no, no. I've been very spoiled. My mother is wonderful. She fed me really well. and. Mm -hmm. And I ate all her food and never learned, even though she tried to teach me. So this is you this are is my kidding. Chance. Yeah. <laughs> well, so this is what I do. This is this is. The... I will try my best, honey. I cook. I you cook do collard cook. greens. You I do. I cook all the southern foods. I have very specific recipe for collard greens. Oh, you do. Oh, I do. Now yours may be better than mine. I don't know. Oh. I'm not going <laughs> to challenge you. Oh, no. <laughs> Down I it. wouldn't dare do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, salt and pepper. So up to now, y'all, I've got a little mayonnaise, a little sour cream, horseradish, a little apple cider vinegar. If you would finish mixing that up for me, Viola, and mm, I'm gonna no, just tidy. chop <laughs> us up a few chives to go in it. Oh, I like man, a little color so in it. Yeah. This is great. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take this little plastic bag mm -hmm and cut the corner out of it. And drop mm -hmm. our tip. This is the way I do this because, gosh, I really need to come back as an octopus. Mm -hmm. You don't have enough hands. Mm -hmm. But if you'll get you a glass, then this is so easy to fill because you've got that glass. All right, girlies. Okay. We're going to test your squirting skills. Okay. Uh oh. All right. Okay. So, so let, 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 let me show you. Okay. First thing we want to do is get all the air out of yep, it. Exactly. And then you just. Oh, <gasps> man. Okay. That's great. Oh, that's wonderful. Isn't that wonderful? <gasps> Hit it, sister. I am so excited. <laughs> okay. I've always wanted to make deviled eggs. Have you ever done this before? No, I haven't <laughs> I didn't think anything so. before. All right, bring it down into your egg. 
do that little motion. Mm. See? Okay. Ah, oh, this looks so good. Yay! All right, now what I'm fixing to do now is make a salmon rose. Roll it kind of tight mm -hmm. so that will look like that center bud. Oh, okay. See, kind of like that. Bryce! That's nice, yes. Bryce! Mine looks like the tongue of a snake. <laughs> <laughs> so does mine. Mine Look is so thin. Look at her rose. I feel so accomplished. Right. You are accomplished. Don't be telling me you can't cook. <laughs> Thank you, Paul. All right, so I'm going to use our mint and make it look just like a rose. Well, my character in the film, Hilly Holbrook, was very specific about her deviled eggs. And she was also very picky, y'all, mm -hmm. about everything, mm -hmm. about her chocolate pie. <laughs> You'll have to go see the movie or read the book to find out the ingredients that were in that yummy pie. <laughs> oh, no. Coming up, y'all, my cooking lesson continues when I teach Bryce a thing or two about collards. The ultimate teacher, Paula Dean. <laughs> and then I'm going to take y'all to a beautiful place when I glaze up this chicken. And later, I show these girls this simple trifle. How oh, gorgeous. So pretty. Oh, How gorgeous beautiful. is that? I so hope y'all are enjoying the show. And if you do, be sure to click like, subscribe, and the notification bell so you'll never miss a video. And we'll be right back after the break. Oh my God! I specifically said drop old coats at my house, not commodes! Why would you do this to me? I don't know. I don't know, Hilly. <laughs> it's so embarrassing. I go find mommy. We are having so much fun. This is Viola Davis mm -hmm. and this is Bryce Howard. Mm -hmm. And they are the stars in the movie The Help. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what do you think? It's so good. I'm gonna you have like mine it? Now. Mm, the chives. Yes, yes, yes. And um, the horseradish. And oh, this is sour fantastic. Cream. It's so good. good. Yeah. You know, there's so many different ways that you can pump this egg up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm going to show y'all how to pump up that collard green top. Oh, yeah. By making southern collards with cornmeal dumplings. Okay. You can see that it's got that big, thick stem in it. So you just pop it out like that. Okay, so okay. I fold it over. Yes, and I just kind of mash it. Now see, Paul, when we grew up, we ate the stem, everything. Really? We didn't cut anything out. To me, they can just be really stonky. Yeah, exactly. And then what we do is we lay these out just like we would a tobacco leaf. Yep. And then roll we're it. just gonna roll it. Yeah. Just like this. Some people like their sliced very thin. We don't. Mm -hmm. We like ours more like that. Oh, so okay. that's all you Ooh, do. I'm going to try. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let me get my fingers out of the way. Yes, first. definitely. <laughs> now, we've got our collards here in our pot cooking. Oh, that looks so Don't they good. look good? Oh, yeah. So how long have these been cooking for about? The, these have been cooking for about 20 minutes. And see that smoked oh, turkey yeah. wing in there? I well, use turkey drumsticks. Oh, do you? The big ones. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take some of our pot liquor mm -hmm. out and put in this pot right here. It's called pot liquor? Pot, pot liquor. liquor. Yeah. <laughs> now, while I'm doing this, can I ask you to, to mince this onion for me? Can you explain what mincing is? Yes. <laughs> mince. Mince. <laughs> She is so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. <laughs> All right, a mince is finer than a dice. Okay. So we want them about like that. So okay. if you would kind of mince that up just like that. Okay. Now tell me everything that you put in I your I put clothes. everything but the kitchen sink. Vinegar, barbecue sauce. Get out! Mm-hmm. Yes, I do. I like it real spicy, that's why. Well, we put a lot 
of hot sauce. Oh man. So what we're gonna do now is make our cornmeal dumplings. Okay. And I'm gonna add a cup of flour to a cup of cornmeal. So you just blend that up. With the spoon? With a spoon. Mm -hmm. And we've got our onions over here. And I'm gonna put some black pepper and just a wee little dash of salt. All right, so come get your onions from Bryce. Mm -hmm. And we are gonna add some broth mm -hmm. to that. So do I dump it in? Yes, just rake them in there. Oh yeah, nice. Yay. Look at you go. Thank nice. You. The ultimate teacher, Paula Dean. <laughs> All right, so stir that up. And while we make these dumplings, tell everybody the story behind this movie. You know, the story is just about this young girl who comes out of college and she's very different from the rest of her peers. Which Hilly being her best friend, yes. uh -huh. you know? I love that relationship oh, yeah, between absolutely. those two girls. But she decides to write this book about how black domestics feel. Uh huh working for white women in the South in 1962. And the result of that is these white women and, and these black women connect in a way that they ordinarily would not have right. if she would not have started this expose type right. of book. And also it's a great mix of comedy and pathos. And yeah. So right. it's like you're crying, you're laughing, you're right. living with these women. Mm -hmm. It's such an incredible are... story of friendship. I mean, it's yeah. and we had that experience working on the movie. We sure I did. Mean, we all just the got women so close. Are y'all all, all good friends? Yes. We now. are. Yeah. Now see what I'm doing. I'm mm. not stirring this pot. Okay. I'm just shaking it. Okay. Because if I stick a spoon down in there, they're gonna come apart. I'll take this and then just gently pour it okay. over our collard greens. So they'll kind of sit on top. Oh, yeah. Man, this sounds so delicious. <gasps> Coming up, I'm not going to be shy with this glaze for our chicken. Some more, girl. <laughs> <laughs> and then this meal is going to knock you out. This is so good and make you want to slap somebody. I'm so happy. <laughs> and later, our dessert comes together in no time. I feel like this is something that I'm going to do immediately oh, when I yeah. get home. I'm going to take credit for it. <laughs> <laughs> I hope y'all are enjoying the show, and I want to hear from you. Tell me what recipes or videos you'd like to see me make by just leaving a short comment below. Now, let's get back to the show, y'all. All right, ladies, guess what time it is? What time is it? It is time to put your beautiful dumplings in the collard greens. Oh. And everything? Yes. Okay. Y'all have just produced like oh, man, that's beautiful. dumplings. Ah. <laughs> All right, we can't have collard greens without the secret ingredient. You what, what might that be? A stick. <laughs> <laughs> a stick of butter. They have got to be greasy. If they're not, they're just not all that wonderful. All right, so look at there. Look at there. Yeah. You know, and the health benefits from the collards far outweighs that little bit of butter we put in uh -huh. there. <laughs> now, you can't visit me without me sharing the fried chicken recipe with okay. y'all. This is my spicy pecan fried chicken. I'm gonna use one and a half bottles hot sauce. Oh, man. All right, we need about four eggs cracked. Okay. And we're gonna put about this much water, about a fourth of a cup of water, not much. And we are gonna use house seasoning. And our house seasoning has salt, pepper, house. onion powder, and garlic powder. Oh, wow. So it's got everything mm. that you need in it. Do I press it in at all? Yeah, you know, I teach everybody rub their meat. Rub their meat. So like all this? Right, uh-huh, flip your chicken over, put a little bit on the other side. You well, want me to mix this? Yes, chicken? just mix it up. And then we're gonna throw our chicken over in there. I'm adding ground pecans to the flour. Mm-hmm. That sounds pretty good, doesn't it? It sounds real good. And look, see, it's just a little coarse. They're just going to give it a little extra flavor. And then I'm going to take y'all to a beautiful place. 
What place is When that? we're done with it. Oh, <laughs> man. All right, doll, that's probably way, way too much. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm so sorry. What do that I do? That is all right. What we're going to try to do... Is wipe it, it off? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and then... <laughs> I got so passionate about I know, it. What did you do? You put too much on? I, I did, don't want I did. all your blood to be dried up okay. when you leave. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you can't say our chicken ain't seasoned. <laughs> <laughs> now, the thing about frying chicken, uh -huh. dark meat takes about 13 to 14 minutes, depending on how large your chicken is, and the white meat will take about 10 to 12 minutes, depending on uh, how large it is. Mm -hmm. Let me tell y'all something. I had the most wonderful time watching the help. You talking about passion? Oh yeah, Damn. it was a passion project. That's why when people see it, they're so they're going to be so moved by it because I could everyone's tell. heart was in it. I could everyone's tell, heart. Viola. Mm -hmm. All right, now I'm going to wash this goop out of my hands. So, Paula, what did you think of the fried chicken scene of the movie where Minnie is is? teaching Celia how to cook. It feels like you and I here. I loved it. I loved it. And you know, Minnie did it just like my mother used to do it in the brown sack. Yeah, that's what so my mom street. did it too. Mm. Yes. Shake that. Chicken already dead, Miss Eddie. <laughs> yep, he dead. That was a wonderful take me back moment. Oh, yes. If you would put that stick of butter, and then we've got some honey. Mm -hmm. oh, I like the sound of this. Yeah, about a half a cup. Yeah. Go, baby. Men have been showing More you how that. to measure. I can tell right now. <laughs> Some more, girl. <laughs> <laughs> now about a half a cup of pecans. Okay. And we're going to let that just simmer. Mm -hmm. Coming up, this delicious meal is going fast. When can we eat it? Can eat it? Right now. Dig mm -hmm. in. And then this trifle will sweep you off your feet. This is so good. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh, my goodness. I so hope y'all are enjoying the show, and if you do, be sure to click like, subscribe, and the notification bell so you'll never miss a video, and we'll be right back after the break. Okay, here we go, girls. Okay. <laughs> this is over oh, the top. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh my Southern goodness. fried chicken oh with gosh. a pecan glaze. Mm. All right, I can't wait for y'all to when eat. When can we eat it? Can eat it right now. Dig mm. in. Miss Paula Dean, <laughs> this is so good. It make you want to slap somebody. I'm so happy. <laughs> mm, I'm so happy. Bring me back home. My mother's cooking, and it's one of those things that no matter... How much my mom tells me how to make something, mm -hmm. I can't make it like her. That's how I feel about this. Mm -hmm. I can't make a, my greens is not as good as this, Paula. They're not. Mm-mm. That says a lot because every time we would go to any kind of a cook-off, Viola would say, my food is better. <laughs> for, her to, for her to come here and defer to you like this, it means well, a lot. See, but I don't put butter in my greens. I think that, that's a lick. That's yes. a lick. That yes. took. That? Yes, it takes it. And free. the hot sauce you put in there? Yes. It's so no, good, I'm sweating. <laughs> I know, <man. laughs> I'm breaking out into sweat. Me too, <laughs> So I want to give y'all a little dessert. I want to make y'all a little dessert before you have to go. It's my milk and cookies trifle. I have just run up to the bakery mm -hmm. at the grocery store and bought these cookies. Now you can use any kind you want. Just dunk those cookies down in that milk. Every cookie needs a cloud to sit on, doesn't it? <laughs> That's heavy cream mm -hmm. that has been that. whipped. Mm -hmm. There we go. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah. I feel like this is something that I'm going to do immediately oh, when I yeah. get home, and everyone's going to say, yes. this is what you learned from Paulatin. I'm going to say, yes. Yes, I, I did. Mean, I'm going to take credit for it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you're supposed to. <laughs> All right, and if we I had... I do this. If we had, like, maraschino cherries or blueberries or, you know, you could stick any kind of fruit in it. So look at this. Oh, How man. long did it take us? Two minutes? Two Not minutes. Even. So we have like an instant trifle, don't we, girls? We sure do. Always have to eat your vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> How oh, gorgeous. Oh, it looks so pretty. Oh, How gorgeous is that? That's beautiful. I'm in mean, three minutes. Oh, oh my, my gosh. Look. Oh. Here, Bryce, you... You can dip your own because uh, I'm going to be eating mine while you're dipping this. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this looks so good. You like This it. is so good. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh, my goodness. Girls, I have to tell you, the help really, really touched me. Oh. I mean, it touched me deep mm -hmm. because it was like stepping back 40 years, 50 mm -hmm. years. But what took it over the top for me was all those Southern women in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. I cannot thank y'all enough for being here with me today. Oh. Hey y'all, it's Paula Dean. Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell to be alerted when I post a video. Love and best dishes, y'all.